Just yesterday, Russia's Su-57 fighter jet landed in China for the Zhuhai Air Show, and it's once again turning heads, but not for the reasons its creators had hoped. The plane's latest appearance further tarnishes its reputation, as it's been confirmed that the jet has no stealth capabilities whatsoever. Regardless of its sleek design or radar-absorbent coating, the Su-57's capabilities seem to suffer under scrutiny. When an observer at the airshow pulled out their phone to take a close-up photo of the aircraft, they had no idea they'd inadvertently revealed a key detail that could go viral. The snaps provide an unprecedented look at the Su-57, showing off its construction in a way that's rarely been seen before. What stands out is the surprising number of screws dotting the fuselage and wings, hundreds, in fact, rather than the rivets typically used in stealth aircraft designs. The use of screws instead of rivets raises serious concerns about the plane's stealth capabilities. Rivets create a tighter, smoother bond between panels, while screws stick out slightly, reflecting radar waves. This distinction is important, because even the smallest surface irregularities can increase the likelihood of radar detection. Each imperfection compromises the aircraft's stealth profile, making it more vulnerable to enemy radar systems. In addition, riveted joints ensure structural integrity under the strong forces experienced during high-speed maneuvers. Unlike screws, which can loosen due to vibration, riveted joints remain secure and stable, a critical requirement for aircraft operating in combat scenarios. The aerodynamic properties of stealth aircraft also benefit from rivets, the smooth surfaces they provide minimize drag, allowing for more efficient and agile flight. At the speeds involved, especially those approaching or exceeding the sound barrier, even small surface irregularities can significantly impact aerodynamic performance. In addition, the precision required to apply radar absorbent coatings requires a smooth substrate. Rivets allow for a more uniform application of these specialized coatings compared to screws, which can require adjustment and can develop microcracks. Any defects in these coatings not only increase the risk of detection but also reduce the effectiveness of the stealth technology itself. The Su-57's wing screw problem first came to attention a few years ago, when footage released by the Russian Air Force showed the aircraft up close. The video clearly shows screws on the outer wings and other fuselage panels, raising questions among military experts and aviation enthusiasts. Stealth technology requires smooth surfaces and meticulous attention to detail in every component to minimize radar visibility. Thus, the choice to use screws instead of rivets raises doubts and suspicions. Experts speculate that the screws may be a temporary fix used during the prototyping phase or for pre-production aircraft to facilitate possible modifications or repairs. However, it seems inappropriate for an aircraft that is touted as cutting-edge technology intended for operational missions and demonstrating stealth capabilities. Another theory is that the screws are used to secure easily replaceable panels or components that require quicker access during maintenance. These panels are typically located in areas considered less critical for radar visibility. However, this explanation does little to assuage skeptics who argue that the screws disrupt the aircraft's sleek aerodynamic shape and compromise its radar-absorbing qualities, which are critical to maintaining stealth capabilities. The ongoing Su-57 saga, particularly its visible propellers, highlights the technological hurdles and production challenges Russia faces in developing a modern stealth aircraft.
While the Su-57 is intended to compete with other fifth-generation fighters such as the F-22 and F-35, the details cast doubt on the quality of its manufacturing standards and the robustness of its design. Comparing the stealth characteristics of the F-22, F-35, and Su-57 reveals not only technological innovations but also strategic differences in their approaches to invisibility. The F-22 Raptor, with its astonishing radar cross-section, RCS, of just 0.0005 square meters, represents the pinnacle of stealth technology. Its sophisticated geometry and flat surfaces are specifically designed to minimize radar wave reflection, making it nearly invisible to enemy detection systems. In contrast, the F-35 Lightning II, a multi-role fighter, takes a different approach to stealth, achieving an RCS of around 0.005 square meters. Despite its higher radar signature than the F-22, the F-35 combines good stealth with advanced sensors and communication systems. Its versatility makes it a preferred choice for contemporary military operations, despite lacking the extremely low visibility of its predecessor. However, the Su-57 struggles to match the stealth levels of American fighters. With an RCS ranging from 0.1 to 0.5 square meters, the Su-57 remains detectable by radar, raising doubts about the effectiveness of the stealth technology used in its design. Despite its impressive maneuverability and extensive armament, the compromises made in its stealth capabilities underscore the challenges Russia faces in producing a modern fighter. However, the Su-57 struggles to match the stealth levels of American fighters. With an RCS ranging from 0.1 to 0.5 square meters, the Su-57 remains detectable by radar, raising doubts about the effectiveness of the stealth technology used in its design. Despite its impressive maneuverability and extensive armament, the compromises made in stealth capabilities underscore the challenges Russia faces in producing a modern fighter.